Hello Rio Grand Valley, this is Nelson Martinez with Armory Painting and I wanted to make this video because there is a lot of misconception about cabinet painting and cabinet refinishing. They are two different things and I will show you what it takes to refinish cabinets. Painters have different ways and many different styles of doing this and I will show you what we like to do and what works best for us. We like to take our time with each door and give it the love and care that it deserves to make sure we give you quality and the best job that we can. All right guys, so I want to show you here um, one of the important parts about prepping cabinets is numbering your doors. If you don't number your doors, you're going to have um, doors placed in the wrong position and then they are not going to be shutting right or they're not going to be level like they were before. So that has a lot to do with it. Mario, what he likes to use here is a crud cutter and he uses this on the doors and cabinets that are closest to the stove area because these are the ones that attract more grease. Um, so this crud cutter here, which is a non-toxic biodegradable, is what uh, he uses here on these doors. And over here, he's using the Dawn dish soap. And this also helps against the grease. guys I just want to show you guys real quick uh, this fist tool um, ext extractor dust extractor that we um, invested in to make uh, these jobs a lot faster these this is a HEPA a dust extractor so you guys can see the difference here when sanding with and without you can see here um, this leaves little um, dust behind and you can see what happens when you don't use a dust extractor so this leaves the job site a lot cleaner and we don't have dust going into the air, into all the, the furniture back there in the living room, which when we get ready to paint, we are gonna cover everything. But right now, we just wanted to give this machine a test and test out the dust that we're gonna be uh, working with. And you guys can see it's very, very effective. This Festool Dust Extractor combined with um, this Surf Prep Sander, which you can see it's got the holes and adapter and everything. So, which is pretty, pretty cool to use. So there you have it. What's up guys, as you guys can see here, we set up a wall of plastic that way we don't have any overspray coming over here into the living room area. Um, we got your zip wall zippers, which are pretty cool to use, makes everything a lot simpler or easy up from Tromeco zippers is what we're using here. Um, we're setting up some exhaust system, um, which is just a fan with some filters to catch all the overspray. And we'll set up everything up nicely over there right now with some plastic and make sure we have um no overspray going up to the wall so we cover everything up so this is what it's looking like so far we got the guy setting up uh the rack right now so this is where the doors are going to go so that's the stack system that mario uses here so you guys can see if we covered up this area as well so everything's looking nice and tight